What's up, guys? Um, we're running uh, thermal tests on the new and the old iPad, and what we have noticed is that the new iPad actually runs hotter than the old iPad, as you can see, a couple of degrees difference actually. So it's significant enough to say that I can understand why. It's because obviously the old iPad don't use as many processors as the new one. You know, the new ones obviously have a quad core um, graphics processor and a dual core CPU compared to the um, original iPad, which is a regular uh, single core. So you can tell right then and there that the new iPad is definitely running hotter than the old, which means if it's running hotter, it's using more energy. Keep that in mind. Nothing runs hot just by because okay so to summarize the new iPad actually dissipates uh, actually I should say uh, emits more heat than the old iPad and uh, we just speculating that's due because the new iPad uh, uses more uh, CPU power more graphics power uh, to get this um, thing to work you know get the screen resolution as sharp as it is so that's just an observation um, would that lead to shorter battery life? We're gonna find out. We're gonna find out. Is um is that gonna affect the battery life? Yes, we will. All right. So we will we'll be back.